Hi there, my name is Missy Carpenter of Traditional Primitives and today I would like to go ahead and share with you how to fill up this starch brush that I use for my starch basting technique. You can purchase this one of two ways. You can get it by itself in packaging like this or you can buy it as part of our English Paper Piecing Starter Kit. Uh, if you buy it here, it is already filled, so um, you're just going to need to pull off the foil seal and it's ready to go. If you purchase it empty and alone, please read the instructions on the back, as well as this little sticker here. The company that produces these for me puts a stiffening agent into the bristles and we need for you to rinse those off. Uh, just go ahead and put it underneath a gentle uh, flowing water and just sort of let this uh, water soak into the stiffening part and get that nice and rinsed. You can also use a small bowl and just let it soak for a little while. After you rinse the, the tip of the bristles off, go ahead and unscrew it. And inside there is a disc. I don't want you to lose that disc. So just be real careful. Don't walk across your carpet with it uh, or don't unscrew it and then tip it upside down over your sink. Just keep it upright like this to rinse out the inside and then just blow a few capfuls like that uh, and that will rinse out the stiffener that's inside this plastic part of the lid. Uh, you can also just soak it in a small bowl of water for a few minutes to let that soften and get out of there. Then go ahead and put the cap back on and you're ready to use it. Now to fill it we're just gonna use the premium quilting starch. Just press down gently and unscrew it Sometimes you have to turn it three times to get it off. It is a leak-proof bottle and perfect size for traveling, so it's airplane safe. Then once you're ready to fill, just go ahead and put that tip right into the hole of the brush and you've got it filled, ready to go. You can find these products on traditionalprimitives.com. Thank you.